Some chains can never be broken. I lost 15 years. Buried alive. Erased. You left me. Rotting in that hellhole and never looked back. But you can't outrun the past. And when it catches up, when all your lies collapse around you, I'll be there, sifting through the wreckage. You owe me. What in the hell is going on, skin tubes? DeCali here with my thoughts on the Uncharted 4 Thief's End gameplay. Showing up the PlayStation experience. Uh, not only are the graphics stunning, but the game just looks very, very fucking badass. Before I go into too much detail on um, my thoughts on all this beautiful fucking shit... I actually like to look back at where it all started. So, I know um, Uncharted Drake's Fortune, the you know the very first one, was looked to be basically the saving grace for Sony with many disappointments and exclusives lost. So, uh, in my opinion, I think it was Uncharted Drake's Fortune. You're basically thrown into the action. Kind of like yesteryear's Indiana Jones movies. Here they come. So he sets on a path of uh, to unearth the secrets of his ancestor, Sir, Fa Sir Francis Drake, and totally immerses you in the experiences. His experiences is pretty badass. So as you get to witness right here, that uh, I haven't uh, played this game for a while. So yeah, I'm all over the damn place. With the uh, yeah. Anyway, yeah, when I first initially started playing this game, I kind of thought, is this a Tomb Raider ripoff or something? What the hell? Make it sound so dirty. <laughs> but as most of you watching know, this is not Tomb Raider. Drake, or Nate as I call him, has a unique fighting style all his own, and it continues to improve throughout the game's predecessors. Now, I thought was pretty cool was uh, when I first started playing this game was the grass. And uh, obviously compared to uh, the grass in Uncharted 4, which is way better. But, I don't know, the grass was pretty cool in this one. And, you know, all the cover and uh, pretty much the whole gameplay was pretty awesome to me. me. That's not what the hell you guys came here to see. You came here to see some Uncharted 4 footage. Of course, right. you've probably already seen it come by here? in Tall, plenty of other places. But big, stupid ideas about pirate treasure. So, yeah, this looks pretty awesome. All the shrubbery, the water, too much water. So, he's still got his journal. And, of course, if you uh, pause it right here, you can see a wedding ring on his wedding finger. I just thought that was interesting. All right, so... is pretty awesome stuff. Now I've noticed that his climbing is a little bit different, maybe a little bit slower because, you know, he's getting up there. Up there with age. Are you trying to climb up there? In those boots? <laughs> now, uh, somebody on the, I think it was the Uncharted um, community Facebook group said, that he wasn't going to be as witty as he usually is, and I don't know. I kind of, I can kind of hear he's still got his wit. So, Ew. pretty sure you don't need this. So this is pretty cool. Although, uh, yeah, it's it's pretty awesome to have that. <laughs> so that's a pretty pretty cool added feature there. Kind of 
kind of Tomb Raider-ish, if you ask me. Ah, I did not see that. Okay, okay, enough about the Tomb Raider stuff. We're here to talk about Uncharted 4. And it's beautiful, beautiful freaking scenery. Look at the freaking grass and all the other shit. It's freaking so badass. It's so badass, yes. Oh, I don't love how the freaking, how they have him climbing. It's just more realistic. Look at the freaking birds flying by. <clears throat> just all around badass. Just, yeah. And a lot of people are complaining. Hey, it's just a hop, skip, and a enormous leap away. A lot of people are complaining about the, uh, you know, the gameplay. It's not as good as the, uh, uh, whatever. It's, you know, it's in pre-alpha. Come on. Gameplay is not going to be exactly like... Anyway, it's not going to be the same as, you know. So, <clears throat> people need to stop bitching about that shit. We're still a good year away from, you know, the completed... I love this, how you can hide in the grass. It's freaking awesome. Now... You see where that guy got highlighted? It was like maybe where he almost saw you, but not quite. So I thought that was pretty cool. I was actually going to go through and do um, how Uncharted 2 and Uncharted 3 looked compared to this. And I just, eh, I don't have time for that crap. And actually, with the headset, you can hear these guys in different positions. Give me that. So that's pretty badass. Just the sneaking around part is uh, its pretty cool. Ah, I love that. I love that feature you can hide. Be more sneaky. You got any repellent? I wonder what they're uh, what they're trading down there. See how that guy was highlighted? It's like he did see you, so obviously this is pretty cool shit right here. All the combinations you can do here. All angles. Oh, whiter than ghost. All right, this is pretty cool right here. Oh, grenade. Blammo! Fucking badass. Some cool shit right here. Cool, cool shit. This board just looks awesome. Here's something you might not have seen in the original. So-called death glitch that they uh, keep talking about. Now, obviously, when they were when they made this little gaming preview, they didn't add in or have programmed, you know, like a death scene or whatever. <clears throat> But I didn't see that part on the original. But I thought I'd add that just for the hell of it. And why not? God. Cannot wait to play this game. Now this part's pretty cool. 
Obviously, it's a little bit different than all the other ones. <clears throat> they actually have a chance to maybe survive you pulling them off a ledge. I'm wondering if that'll be in the MP. Now, this is what... Yeah, blind fire should be. You're... Blind fire, you're firing blind. You're, you can't see a goddamn thing what the hell you're shooting at. That explosion was awesome looking, too. I'm right here, you asshole. <laughs> oh, damn. Now, see, this is what I think is badass, okay? They know that you're here, but you can hide still. And they basically go back into search mode. And you can just sneak attack their ass and kill them. Cool shit. Of course, now you got seen again, but... Pretty fast-paced shit. <laughs> That's so cool. The guns sound awesome, too. This is badass. Love it. A lot of this I'll probably be cutting. I'll be cutting out because you know it's. I didn't want it to run too long. You guys have already seen this shit anyway. I would imagine probably like 20 or more times. But I just wanted to, you know, show my share my thoughts. I mean, I'm pretty sure they're pretty close to the same as everybody else's thoughts. All right. Now, right here, the guy can actually hear him go through the grass. I thought that was pretty cool. The AI is obviously a hell of a lot better in this one than it is in the previous games. I mean, maybe you can hear you sneak around and it's just kind of aware. Yeah, see? Like, he hears Drake go up on the on the ledge, and that's what draws his attention back. There's just guys everywhere. So I have a feeling the AI is going to be pretty awesome in this. Ho hopefully the friendly AI will be just as just as good, if not better, to where they don't get in your damn way. Although in the other ones, they don't really get in your way that much anyway. I don't think anyone saw me. This little grappling hook is pretty awesome. New little added feature. So that's pretty cool. Overall, I mean, it, it, it looks really awesome to me. And I, personally, I don't really have any complaints. Like I said, it's still, the game is still a year out. They still got a whole bunch of improvements they can do. You know, I'm pretty sure they're looking all over at the, you know, what the community is saying about the gameplay, this and that and the other. <clears throat> I mean, I'm pretty sure they are, they've, you know, they know what the hell they're doing. They don't need our input shit. So this is pretty awesome right here. Good old classic Uncharted get about halfway up somewhere and shit starts crumbling. So you have to hurry and get your ass up there before it all comes tumbling down. This is where we meet Nate's supposed brother. I nearly shot your head off. 
Sam. Oh, you're okay. Yeah. Nothing I can't walk away from. <laughs> it's good to see you alive, little brother. Come on. So all in all, I really, really look forward to this. And uh, it's going to be freaking awesome. So, with that being said, we will see you the next time, YouTube. I hope you enjoy. Peace! Yeah. Keep smiling, asshole. I'll see you soon. I laugh at your pain. <laughs>